Well, there's a spot in Habit to Grace. It's one of the most interesting places we've been in for our Where's Marty? Yes, Marty has a look for us this morning. We're loving what we're seeing so far, Marty. Yes, we're here for the glam. Well, Cena. Well, Cena K2 just pointed something out to me. We visited John Cliff Savage and Washington Street Books and Entertainment Museum before you arrived at WJZ. Uh, it's when Denise was uh, sitting in the chair when we were waiting for you to make the move here from Cincinnati. So you've not seen any of this. How did you? How did you start? Shortly, uh, briefly, how did you start collecting all these costumes? Well, I fell in love with a film called The Last Samurai with Tom Cruise. Just it. It just reached into my heart and tugged, and I said, I want to own a piece of that, so I started collecting. The problem was, I always tell people, never let your kids tell you not to do something, because it's like pouring gas on a flame. My son said, can't buy any more costumes, so he started displaying them, and here we go. We now have uh, 49 on display, and we have over 1,500 costumes in our store. I want you to think about that. Matter of fact, tell them real quick before we get to this. You have the costumes from the Hunger Games we showed back when we were here in the early summer. Yeah. Um, somebody put a TikTok video up that has how many views? We've had over 337,000 views, over 52,000 likes, and 477 questions of where is this place? So uh, TikTok, uh, thank you very much. It bringing people from all over the world. It's in Habit of Grace, Maryland. You you would not expect it. Now, we were talking about this, $35,000. This is probably the rarest of all the costumes from the movie Respect. This was designed by Clint Ramos to reproduce a particular costume that was worn by Aretha Franklin years ago. Uh, it's called the Amsterdam Dress. This is made up of 25 pounds of Zagorski crystals and pearls and seed beads. It took three months to make. It's the rarest of all the dresses that were produced for this particular film. And you've got to give Jennifer Hudson an amazing creds for wearing this and also wearing heels while she was performing on stage. This is all in the posters and stuff. It's one of the most beautiful dresses we have. And you've got, we've only got about 15 seconds before we have to, we, we, coming up next half hour, we're going to show you more from the collection from the movie right down there. Respect. Yeah, I mean, John, this is just one of the most fascinating Thank you places so much. we visited in 2022, and it's our pleasure to come back and do a bit of an encore. Yeah. Meg, you'd look, you, you would you would stop traffic in that dress, huh? You would. I and need heels. It. Well, I those need heels it. are nowhere near <laughs> big enough for Meg. I worry that it's a tad bit out of my price range. Is it $35,000? <laughs> Um, maybe I could do a payment plan. Right, it's, it's, right. <laughs> Pay with your sunshine personality. It's 35 k but we know John. We know we may be able to get it for you for 33.5. I could do that. Is yeah. it enough? Is it okay, I'm yeah. going to save up. I'm going to start saving. Sold. Maybe in 2030, I'll be there. Right. Exhibit. It has to stay 